Alright guys, welcome back to more Let's Play uh, Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. We had to restart a few things. I'm not going to go down there. I know that there's a uh, badge down there. There we go. Thank you. Um, where we ended up... Uh, we got knocked out and so I missed... Um, we had to like redo a good portion of stuff. Really? Only a coin? I don't know why. I thought that was something else. But uh, we were we were able to get an amazing Daisy uh, beaten in the last video, which is great. Almost had two, which would have been fantastic. All right, we got the cookbook. We have to we have to do a little bit of uh, recollection, but that's fine. That ice smash will come in handy at some point. Okay, I see a key. We will need to go down there at some point. I do think I still want to do this, though. Alright, in the darkness, we now get Flower Saver. Oh, do I have badge points? I have three badge points. Oh, I can, I can reorganize what I have. Uh, that stays on, that stays on, that stays on. Quake Hammer's really good. I'll keep the sleepy bounce for now. And then, uh, no, no, no. Badge points needed, please. Uh, PowerPoint plus. HP plus. And a... A hammer throw. And pretty lucky. I think that's good. I just want to look. Yeah, 30, 25, 25. Coops is now up to 20, which is great. Do I have space? I do. Perfect. Free all of the booze. Okay, it's quiz time. Interloper. Just now, when the box opened, how many of us booze came out? The answer is 200. We get <laughs> called a math nerd, which is very fitting. We get an ultra shroom, which will become very useful. Uh, we're gonna want Goombella out. Okay, so we do have to say no. We've already gone through this dialogue, so I'm just kind of going through it as quickly as I can. We wait until we get surrounded. There we go. He who he, you said you'd be nice. Alright, so we'll get the atomic boo. Yeah! Okay.
Obviously, we tattle first. Atomic Boo. Giant Boo made up of, of a ton of smaller Boos. HP is 40, attack is 4, defense is 0. This thing will try and smush us. It can also split up and send hundreds of Boos at us. But when we attack, we... And when we attack, we might get so scared that we get confused or can't move. I'm sure... I sure wouldn't want to see this thing standing behind me in the middle of the night. Creepy. Okay. And I can't... I can only hammer throw it. Which I don't think I want. We'll go to Speedy G. Okay. That works. Okay, that did how much? So he would have been at 33, so that only did 6. Oh, so... Wow, okay, so for Yoshi, it only powers up his first hit. That's kind of annoying. Highly doubt that I can put him to sleep, but... I'll take the less damage. I think actually a body slam might not be a bad idea. So Yoshi does do more damage, but if the... Uh, if the opponent has a... Defense increase, then somebody like Flurry or Goombella will do more damage. That got me seven. Um, uh, seven coins for doing that. Hey, I will take the health increase. Get all of the booze in the audience. And because he's so low on health that... That's why the attack didn't go for that long. There we go. I'll take 19 experience. That's not bad. Hurrah! What's this? What's this? Lucky start. Make something good happen when you first enter battle. Oh, that's a four? Okay. Um, get rid of the super appeal. Get rid of the pretty lucky. Get rid of... Um, not refund. Coins are always great. Oh, we'll get rid of the piercing blow for now. Lucky start. There we go. Okay. So we've done everything that we can do by going down there. So now I think... Um, I think we want to go this way. Ooh. We may have already gotten that guy. Oh, well, I've already been electrified. Okay, we need Goombella. I've tattled a boo before? I don't remember tattling a boo, but if it says I've tattled a boo, then I guess I've tattled a boo. Swooper. That's a swooper. I bet they call it that because of the way that it swoops around. Wow, that's some awesome naming work. Seriously, it's pure naming genius. So anyway, max HP is 6, attack is 3, defense is 0, says here it hangs from the ceiling. You can just damage it, it ought to drop off the ceiling, then you can whack it. 
Okay. Well, I mean, Flurry can attack anyone anywhere. She just has to body slam over there. I mean, I'll take the extra audience, I guess. Okay, well, there's nothing really that I can do here, so I'm just going to defend. Okay. So, boos are only giving us one star point now. Ooh, I got a, I got a hammer hit. Okay. HP will recover briefly. Nice. Like, obviously, with the zap tap, if I end up getting, you know, the electricity at the start of the battle, uh, it's kind of worthless. But I mean, you know, getting a little bit of HP increase or flower point increase, maybe it'll randomly turn me invisible. Like, that sounds amazing. It's a red button. It doesn't look like really there's anything else here, so let's hit the red button. There we go. All right, we have a staircase. You missed, boo. All right, coops. Thank you. We got the steeple key. So now we'll come over this way. So many boos. Oh. Thought I wasn't going to get hit because he was flying back up. Dodgy. Ooh, okay. So we'll Quake Hammer. We'll switch to Goombella. And Head Bonk. That's all the boo's going to do is float up. Kind of like worthless. Nice. I'll take the counter. Three star points. Okay, got him. Dizzy dial on the boo, so we'll take out the boo first. I don't need electricity. There we go. Easy peasy. Extra stew star points. I'll take the coins too. So if we come this way, can we actually go to the left? No, we can only go to the right. But back here is a golden tree, which gives us a golden leaf. Which heal I think that said ten flower points. Let's just check. Yeah. We are going to want a couple of those. Uh, so we do this. Uh, 
Then we do it again. Then we open this up. And we can climb the stairs again. Piranha plant. Ghost. And something else. I do like the dodgy. You missed. Alright, so this was a free battle. Another piranha plant. Jump. Save. Open the door. We'll heal up. Also, we'll just check something. No? Ah. I would have thought. And think of the staircase it takes to get up to your room. Boom. Hey, hang on there, Slick. What are you doing interrupting my me time? This is the monster the mayor was talking about? You gotta be kidding me. Who are you calling a monster? What's your problem? Why do you need to pick a fight? I'm busy thinking up new pranks and stuff. It's not easy either. Now get lost. Of course, you guys won't... Of course you guys won't. No way you ninnies go away quietly, am I right? Well, alright then, Slick. Fine. Yes, I'll turn the villagers into pigs. Big deal. Big deal. You big jerk. Why would you do something like that? Well. You know, they're all so depressing and boring and dimwitted all the time. So instead of wallowing in gloom, I figured they might as well wallow in mud. Ha! Now they're pigs, get it? Isn't that just so perfect? It's like irony or something. Oh my god. <laughs> so, what? You got a problem with that? I guess you do. So let's play Slick. Is that a pipe coming out of his roof? It is a pipe. Ooh, flower points will briefly recover. That is awesome. Tattle? Question mark. Question mark? Wow, how totally bizarre. This thing isn't even listed in here. There's a monster in here that looks like this thing, but it doesn't list a name. HP is 40, attack is 4, defense is 0. It apparently really good at transforming itself in other things. Maybe it used that power to turn the villagers into pigs. This thing is a real jerk. Well, since I'm getting, um... Flower points back, might as well go out with the flower points. Yuck, yuck, yuck. I guess I'll get down and dirty if you're gonna play like that, Slick. Well, okay, take a, take a damage. Oh, look, we got flower points back. Throw eggs at enemies to shrink them to tiny size. Yeah, why not? Yep, Yoshi was, uh, pooping eggs. Did six damage, though, which is nice. And then we can power smash him again. Hmm, time to regroup here. So, you think you're a couple of heavies, huh? Well, that, my dear friends, if you thought changing folks into pigs was impressive, then you're gonna love this. I've got something very special for you here. How do you like them apples? Now that's magic, people. Now you're fighting yourself. Ha! I'm a dang genius. Okay, well, 
let's ground pound. I missed. Hammer. I also missed. He also missed. What a waste of time. I wonder if I put another PowerPoint Plus on and then use Yoshi's Ground Pound, will that do 3 2 and then 1 1 1 1? Because right now it does two followed by four ones. So I wonder if it would do three, two, one, one, one. Which would be eight damage total. Well, hold on. What? What? Huh? You beat me. Nineteen. Hey, that levels us up. <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> That was the exact amount that I needed. Bad points. This is getting ridiculous. <laughs> Man, that was so easy. You got a crystal star. Man, that was such a quick chapter. Mario defeated the scourge of Creepy Steeple and found the fourth crystal star. The people of Twilight Town have surely recovered from their awful curse by now. At this rate, Mario's quest to collect all seven crystal stars will be done in no time. With his back to Creepy Steeple, Mario sets out towards his bright future. Easy peasy. That's it? That's all you got? Man, this guy was a wimp. That wasn't even fair. Well, who cares, right? We've got a crystal star, so let's get out of here. I mean, the fact that, you know, we didn't go immediately to Peach. Well, oh my god, we are the shadow guy. What? Alright. We need to do a rework of our badges now. Um... So anything that has a P on it, we don't need. Quick change, we don't need. HP plus, we don't need. That's the only P stuff that we have. So we can go defend plus. Flower saver is not a bad idea. Happy heart. Pretty lucky. Damage dodge. Close call. Last stand. Ice smash. Shrink. Multi. Or actually, no. I don't want multi bounce. I want flame charge. Or whatever it's called. Fire drive. That's it. What's this do? It takes damage, occasionally recover one flower point. Ah, oh, that's, I mean, that's doable. All right, we no longer have our partners. Is there a, uh, is there anything over here? Like maybe behind the TV or something? In the bed? Well, the bath is just solid milk, I guess. Jump down. Nope. Okay, so we are significantly depowered. Um, because we don't have our partners anymore. I think we can come down here. I'm going to grab another golden flower. Um, if it's respawned. It's possible that it hasn't, which, in that case, then we'll have to... Nope, it has. Cool. Thank you. 
Yeah, I have no idea how many of those that we need. Um, I think we need one for a request, one to cook with a uh, turtley leaf. Um, and then maybe, maybe a couple more in order to do like various recipes and stuff. I have not looked up the recipes. I really should. <laughs> yes, this time we'll take that Mario and get his map. With this super bob bomb here, there's no way we can fail. No, not likely. Gah. Vivian, hand me that glorious super bob bomb. Huh? Vivian, don't you dare. Does that huh mean what I think it does? I I never had it. You were holding it just two seconds ago. You said it was too important to trust me with. Oh, you terrible liar! Stop making up stories to cover for yourself. If I don't have it, then obviously you must have it, and obviously you lost it. Or, are you trying to imply that I lost it, you little lollygagging web? <laughs> no, I... Uh, of course not, Beldum. Well, we can't do much without it, now can we? Oh, you're such an idiot! Very well. I am sure you must have dropped it around here somewhere. So why don't you look for it while Marilyn and I go take a well-earned siesta? And if you try and find it, if you don't find it, well, you know what will happen, don't you? I... I get punished? That's right, you little twit. So get cracking. Come, Marilyn. Let's leave this useless little fool to her chore. Yeah! That's like Vivian Cinderella or something. Wait. Was that the mom? I think I just saw the mom. That ended up getting turned into pigs in front of her kids. Alright. So what's really annoying about this chapter... Is, um... The constant... And even more so than, um... The other chapters. The back and forth... Um, I will just say that right now. Did not want to get into a fight with you unless you're alone. You are not alone. You might be able to dodge some attacks. I just want to run away. Thank you. Okay, I can pick up a couple of my coins that I lost. That just... This just looks disgusting, so no thank you. Whew. Give me that coin and that one. Okay. Got around that one. Good. We can't take these on without the help of a partner um, to really help deal some damage. Especially since we have only been badge pointing. Um, it makes doing fights alone extremely difficult. Okay, nope, nope, nope. I mean, with those being just Goombas, I'm sure I could do that one. But it's still... no. Hey, what's up, Slick? Been waiting for ya. <laughs> yeah, you're Mario, right? What a great name. And I really dig this body, too, man. I can't I jump now? And hey, you're so popular around here, I get mobbed. I just love being you. Yeah, it's so cool. I don't think I ever want to stop. So, you figured out it out yet? You figured it out by now yet? Right, Slick? Your body and name belong to me now. See, I have, I've got this power to change my shape into anyone I want. It comes in handy. But to really be somebody, I had to take their name and body, too. Which means you turn into a shadow and can't use your name. Tough break, Slick. That's not enough, either. I aim to erase you for good. I guess it'd be unsporting to ruin you without a challenge. I'll give you one chance. If you can guess my real name, then I'll give you back your name and body. What do you say, Slick? This will be fun, right? Now, guess, what is my name? Hit me with your best shot. Hit me with your best shot. 
as you can see here, there's no P in this slot. Wrong Amundo, little nobody. Who'd name their kid that? Prepare for doom, slick. Yuck, yuck, yuck. And don't even think about running from battle here. No running! <laughs> we cannot defeat him. <laughs> oh, can't believe we got, got away. Aw, that's not fun. <laughs> The curse has been lifted since Mario beat that b bad, bad ghost. Ah, the perfect red cap, the, scruff, the scuffed overalls. He's the absolute best. Why don't you do something about your appearance and spiff up like Mario, huh? Now that Mario took care of the cure curse monster, I don't have to guard the gate. But here I am, doing it anyway. Yeah, just to keep the weirders out, you know? Yeah, you look kind of weird. If I had to classify you, you'd be a bad guy. Well, that's mean. Anyone here? I have an idea! Into the fireplace! No, I guess not. I thought maybe uh, it would like take us to a second floor or something, but I guess not. I've been thinking lately. I don't really want to be a pig, but being a crow would be okay. Because then I could fly. No one ever heard of a flying pig. Literally a saying. Spite pouch. Huh. I was here in this shop. No, untrue, monsieur. When I awoke, I was here in this shop. I swear to you, I did not lie. Please, say something. Madame, I meant you. No harm. I promise. Believe me. You can't. Why were you in here while I was gone? Answer me. Perhaps I don't want to know. No. I do. Tell me. Be honest. It's my shop. She's my wife. I don't want to have to use a ninja punch to blast you out of here. Now speak. <laughs> you can. <laughs> oh, this is awkward. I guess the pig wasn't my husband after all. The guy is younger and cuter than my husband, actually. Dude, he he's right there. <laughs> what a strapping fellow. Perhaps it's time I traded him for a new husband. <laughs> no, I'm only fooling. Greetings! Welcome to the Twilight Shop. <laughs> okay. Oh, actually, I do want a store. Fifteen. Wow, we are really uh, filling up our storage. Uh, we'll store a super shroom. And we'll withdraw. So what do we have in here? We have a peachy peach jelly jam. We have a life shroom. Ice storm I know we need at some point. I honestly think we need all of this at some point. Oh, that is, that is disgusting that we have all of that that we are going to need at some point. The curse was oink lifted. That Mario sure was oink something, wasn't he? Ah, I can't stop oinking. What should I oink do? The moon granted my wish. I never turned into a pig. Someone living on the moon must have heard my wish. Who... Who do you think lives there? A uh, little green men, obviously. Ha! <laughs> Too funny. You must be a dreamer. What an imagination. What if I say Princess Peach, though? Ha! <laughs> Too funny. You must be a dreamer. What a... Oh, so he says the same thing no matter what. Oh, hey, it's the girls! Hi, girls! Hi, we are the Traveling Sisters 3! Hey, I think we were pigs until a moment ago. No way! We're not pigs! But if we were, we'd be such cute ones, huh? <laughs> oh, here's the mom. Thanks to Mario, our village is back to normal at last. If you see Mario, you should thank him, too. Mommy, I'm hungry. Pork chops. <laughs> Pork chops. Uh, 
What do I do? What do I do? What to do? What to do? Poor me. <laughs> we're free! Yes! We're no longer pigs! I say yoink! No more oink! I just want to sing! Let's talk to the... Oh. Uh... Uh... This is awkward. Hi. Uh, Gonzalez, what's up with you lately? You're kind of freaking me out. I mean, I'm all for acting like a complete loon, but I'm not exact... It's not exactly in your character. My, 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 Mario. You're rather dramatic of late, aren't you? To be honest, dear, I'd rather enjoy our, your quiet dignity and strength of character. Uh, Mario, you seem kind of different. I mean, you sort of... You're sort of like the life of the party now, so I guess that's cool. Boy, Mario, you sure got chatty all of a sudden. I mean, you, like, never talk. Oh, well, I guess it's not too totally weird or anything. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. We owe you so much, Mario. Please, take this as a token of our thanks. Eat up. Is it... Is it steak? Now, who might you be? I don't remember inviting any shadows to my house. Sorry, but Mario is visiting today. If you don't need anything, please leave. Hey, ha, whoa, hey, ha, wah, look at me, look at me. It's a me, Mario. Wah, ha, ha. Okay. All right. <laughs> you ought to move in here. A shadow like you, you fit right in. Know what I mean? Are you saying shadows should only live in one certain area? Oink, 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 oink. I'm practicing for pig time. If I go, if I go to the swine side, I'm going to be more positive. There's no more pig curse? You're kidding. Could you give me some time alone? I want to be a pig in my own thoughts. Nobody will ever tell me what to do. Hey, look at that. <laughs> the super bum bum. Won't Vivian be punished if she doesn't find it? Back to the city. For some reason, you can't enter the pipe. We've been kicked out. Uh, what? A guy with a red cap and some blue overalls? That sounds familiar. Come on, Brain. Oh, yeah, that's Mario. He's this adventurer who saved the village. Are you an adventurer, too? I like adventures. You know, people often say that my shadow is faint. But yours is really something. I mean, you are a shadow. No offense or anything. Uh, I think we have... Talked to everybody. Did I talk to you? You know, you can get through anything if you have good memories to cling to. Now, if I can just figure out how my days as a pig qualify as good memories. <laughs> Alright, let's talk to Vivian. Snail, I'm looking for something very important. If I don't find it, my sister's going to punish me again. But it's just not here. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh bother. What? You found it? I don't know why I'm giving her a pit Winnie the Pooh voice now. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. Thank goodness. At least I won't get punished now. Oh no! It's... it's broken! It must have broken when my sister dropped it. What to do, what to do. I guess I was just meant to be punished for life. Uh... Here, let me fix it. Oh, don't even bother trying. It's really busted. What'll I do now, huh? My sisters will be back any minute. But I do appreciate your offer. Thank you. Hey, wait just a sec. What's your name anyway? Won't you tell me? What? I can't hear you. Your name was stolen, I see. Well, I guess that happens from time to time. Wait, no it doesn't! Your name was stolen! <laughs> That's absolutely crazy! Absolutely. I'm thirsty. We're gonna talk until the sun goes down. Oh wait. Gee whiz, you have way worse problems than I do. And you were worried about me the whole time. That's so kind. Alright, that's it. I'm gonna help you get your name, and your body, and your friends. No, no. Hey, that's okay. Don't worry about my problems. I'm not sure I really want to stay with my sisters anymore anyway. 
And I feel like I need to repay your earlier kindness. It's the right thing to do. We just keep getting kissed. Here we go. Vivian has joined your party. Vivian's ability, a primer. Press X to have Vivian pull Mario into the shadows where they can hide. Nice. When hiding in the shadows, press X to reemerge. In battle, Vivian can set enemies on fire with her Shade Fist. Or she, can, she and Mario can hide in the shadows to avoid damage with her Veil move. I guess we need to find out that ghost's real name first, huh? That'll be a start. Now, how are we going to get that kind of information? Oh hey, I have a sort of idea. Birds pretend to be innocent when people are around, but they're actually really well informed from all that flying and eavesdropping. With my power, you, you can listen in on their conversations without them knowing. So in addition to villagers, let's also try and get some info from the local birds. That's the least I could do for you with my powers. Alright, so she has 15. Which isn't horrible for HP. It is on the little low side. But now we can do... We can get rid of a couple of this stuff. Uh, get rid of the damage dodge. We can get rid of these. We still don't need the, um... The thing that I'm thinking of. Um... We don't need quick change, because we need multiple partners for that. I'm going to get rid of that, add that. So now we have four. So we'll do happy heart and pretty lucky. Actually, we'll do pretty lucky P since we have that random ability that can happen. All right, so now she should be at 20, right? Perfect. All right, that is going to be it for now. And when we come back, eavesdropping with Vivian. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you then.